Hey, hey. Sorry for the noise. It has to do with the fact and I'm not driving, uh, riding my normal route today. Oh my god, the wind's still and now the wind is still picking up. Yeah, and that's when everything got haywire and the sound became really horrible because of the wind. And it had been pretty not too windy and, and then when I wanted to uh, vlog and the, the wind picked up so uh, let's do this here uh, anyway uh, I was just telling you well I was at that time telling you that uh, I took another route and it had everything to do with uh, helping out people um, so my colleague had to uh, take his truck to the garage and since I'm always uh, riding to work with my bike and it's just a small detour for me to put it in the, that specific garage I took it with my bike uh, inside in the back and then tomorrow morning I will ride my bike to the garage and take the truck to work again with my bike in, in the back and uh, basically it's to make things easier for the people at work and for me too because if I didn't do that I would have probably had to take my truck follow him and then take him back to work and then uh, take my bike and go home anyway so <laughs> it was only logical that we should do this like this anyway having said that uh, I told you about the fact that there was a lot of speculation lately about uh, the guy that's gonna retire and who's gonna take his place and so forth and in that story other questions were asked of me particularly because I actually hold uh, a license or, or a school a school diploma as a, a laboratory technician but I never worked there as one and everybody is telling me why don't you work as a laboratory technician and if I had a, a diploma like you or a certificate like you whatever I wouldn't work here and, and I don't know what so a small explanation is probably needed the fact is that uh, the time when I stopped with my school it was still for men for the male population it was still uh, you still had to go to the to the military it was a uh, acquired you had to go it was a law that was later uh, abolished uh, and I was, I think, the um, second, I think there was only one uh, generation after me that, that, that had to do it. So I was a, the penultimate, that was the word I was looking for, the penultimate uh, generation. Um, what also happened was that when I came out of the military, they were in the need of too much uh, laboratory technicians. So when I came out, uh, came out and I came on the, the, the market for a job, they actually told me simply that, you know, you're out of it one year. You haven't done anything in it. You don't have any experience. We can take people who have experience or either people who just left school and are still uh, fresh with the knowledge in it so we're not gonna give you a job and then I had to look for other jobs and I ultimately um, became a garbage truck driver <laughs> I actually started uh, behind the truck with no license to drive a truck and I uh, went for my truck driver's license I think a half year into my career if you can call it that and that's what brought me to this point at this moment so 
I I I I actually am not working as 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 a lab technician because I I didn't get the chance to. But hey, still I'm fairly happy uh, with my life. The problem is that I'm now more than 20 years with this uh, company and more than and 18 years doing the same job that I'm a bit tired of that job that I have a bit stress because of the changed uh, because of a lot of changes that took place and hoping to get this other job and but for the rest it's 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 a uh, it's a regret, but it's not a very big regret. So, anyway, that's what I wanted to tell you, and um, I hope we see each other again tomorrow. And I might wanna take you know that microphone I use for my uh, main channel. I might I might have to test it out in the wind, see if that goes better. But I don't know if I'm gonna do that tomorrow. Anyway, see ya.